You've got to be inside the onion. What we take into account to get the beca is the effort they do to speak in English and their behavior with the teammates and the coaches. What we find very important is that the children show enthusiasm, that they work together hard and that they speak in English. Uh, I'm looking forward to go to Sunderland and get to know uh, how is football there and get to know Sunderland fans and the lifestyle of a professional footballer. Um, I think I, I have to be in the candidates um, because I'm a very hard working person. Uh, I love football and also I think that I'm a great keeper and that can, that can do great things. And I would like a lot being in the candidates for the Becca. Yeah. Um, I can't do that. Um, I didn't do enough, a lot from keeper, um, but I think I improved my foot skills. That I was a bit, a bit bad, um, but I I also improved my English, new vocabulary, new words. I had great fun. I made a lot of friends, and I had some great moments with them. And I think it was a good experience for me. Of, it was it was a long decision, a very hard decision, because the, the standard of English and the standard of football this week has been has been superb. So it's been a very very hard choice to narrow down what 120 kids to, to three uh, finalists and one eventually one winner. Um, so yeah, it's been very hard. We've we've spoke about it at length, um, but I think we've probably come to a, a really good decision. Um, so I'm excited to see see how it unfolds. Um. Um, lots of different things, like I said, first of all the football aspect of it, second of all the English aspect and then again the person as well. Um, it's got to have the respect, got to have the attitude um, and that this is all before the football as well. Um, so they're absolutely massive, massive part of the things we think about, about bringing people to Sunderland. Yeah, if, if it was possible, it would be amazing to take to take quite a few, um, to be honest. But it is what it is, and it, it's part of the reason why it's a hard choice. Um, we'll take one from each week, so two this week, two in Lanusia, one in Prague, so five. That's quite a lot. Um, so it is good, but in an ideal world, of course, you want to take more because there's some very good players here. Um, we've got a lot of things lined up, so we've got our things like our PDC development programme, we've got the, our FCC, which is our foundation community programme, we've got the scholarship programme for older ones, um, and hopefully, fingers crossed as well, we've got stuff like that we can get into the academy. Um, so there's, there's lots of different things that we can do that, and again, away from the football, and we, we'll probably go out for a few meals and a few games of bowling and whatnot, little activities like that, so all part of the, the process and part of the journey.
Y este posición Iker Big drum, come on, because the winner of the Sunderland Becca in 2021 in Segovia is...